Hello, hello, happy Monday. It is snowing like crazy. There's an extreme warning for a snowfall right now. I left the house at like 6 a.m. this morning, so I am exhausted. I just got back, like just as the snow was starting to fall really hard. Travis is gonna try to come home early, but it is scary outside. Like, I keep getting notices that like people are closing early because of like this extreme weather warning. I mean, it's saying like 10 to 15 centimeters of snow, which is a lot, but like, I mean, we normally get a lot more, but I think it's been like a light winter, so everyone's really being precautious. So like, this is kind of what it looks like right now. It's actually quite beautiful. But anyways, I'm very happy that I'm home. Like, I don't want to leave again. My carpet for my office is supposed to come today, so I'm just like patiently waiting. I hope it doesn't get delayed because of this, but we'll see. I am wearing my hooded Star Wars jacket from Maritzia. It's a super warm one, so I haven't worn it that much this winter yet, but I think this is like the perfect time for it to come out now. So I'm also wearing my oversized H&M turtleneck just because like I feel so much more comfortable when I'm wearing something thick and oversized when it's snowing. I don't know, it's just like a comfort thing. And then I'm wearing my Levi's 501 skinnies in the washed black denim. I actually looked at Everlane yesterday to order some jeans, but the duties and taxes are just too crazy. So I am not doing that yet. Maybe if I go to the States this year. And then I'm wearing my Stuart Weitzman 50-50 boots. So I'm probably gonna just like switch into my PJs now, but I'm glad I got to show you what I wore this morning. Definitely a lot more interesting than what I will be wearing for the rest of the day. But fingers crossed if you guys are outside, stay safe, stay warm, and I will see you tomorrow. It is Tuesday, hope you guys are having a great day. It's the afternoon now, I was at home doing work and shooting some campaigns, so I'm really just getting fully dressed now. I'm actually heading out to get my legs waxed because I usually do it at home, but I'm out of those like tongue depressor slash popsicle sticks and I ordered them too late on Amazon so they won't come till later this week. And I, I am wearing my really old Zara hat with a pom pom slash not too old, I actually got it last winter. So I'm wearing my semi-old Zara pom-pom hat from a year ago. And then my Topshop teddy jacket. I got this one last winter, so I don't think they have this exact style anymore, but I picked up a couple things from my parents yesterday, so I have a couple more options now to dress for these outfit videos. I am, I'm wearing my acne oatmeal sweater underneath. I didn't put on any necklaces because I'm getting my underarms waxed too, so I just like, I feel like I shouldn't be wearing any jewelry there. Then I'm wearing my Aritzia belt with my A gold E, like mom style jeans. And then my Common Project sneakers. Hopefully me talking about my waxing appointment isn't TMI. Let me know, I won't talk about it again, but I just thought that I'd tell you what I was doing today. It's not too glamorous, I guess, but everyone's gotta do what they gotta do. Good morning, it is early, early. We are heading, slash me and three other girls that I work with for real estate are heading to Muskoka. We are doing a fun project there, so we're gonna do some research first. It's supposed to be super cold, so I'm like dressed with some of my warmest gear. I'm bringing my snow boots. This is the Woolrich jacket that I find really, really simple to wear because it's big enough that I can wear my oversized sweaters underneath and I feel like for me, the inner layers are more important when I'm trying to stay warm. I'm bringing along my Pam Card jewelry necklace as my go-to for the next three days. And then I am wearing my Acne Studios oversized sweater underneath, it's the navy one. And then I am wearing my Zadege Voltaire belt my loose Leah jeans so that I can sit comfortably for the next couple hours. And then wearing my Stuart Weitzman 50-50 boots. Hey guys, it is Saturday morning. I couldn't film my outfits in Huntsville because they didn't have good mirrors and the lighting was really off. So I'm gonna try to get you two outfits today, one tomorrow and then yeah, you'll just be a short one <laughs> this week, I'm sorry. It just didn't happen in my favor this week. So I am wearing my Aritzia Teddy jacket. We are about to head out to the grocery store. I am wearing my Vince green sweater today. I'm trying to wear it more because I didn't wear it a lot other than during the holidays, but it's so soft and cozy. So I'm trying to find a way to bring a green back into my wardrobe. And then I'm wearing my Aritzia like plaid, almost like sweatpant pants, but they're trouser material. And then my Stuart Weitzman 50-50 boots. You guys wanted to see more of my handbags. This is the bag I brought to Huntsville. It's usually my go-to bag when 
I'm like, I know I'm moving around a lot and I might ruin my bag. So this I've had for, I think, three years now. It's Macage from Clamonico. They don't make it anymore, but I will try to find something similar. It's this type of leather, like the pebbled leather, that is really, really like sturdy. And so you can have it for such a long time. I used to carry like all my schoolwork and stuff in it too because it could fit my iPad and it could fit like some textbooks and stuff. So it is really strong, uh, but I will find something similar to show you because I think it's like a great everyday bag, like Aaron's bag, which is why I bring it with me to the grocery store today. But yeah, I really like a good messenger bag. I think it's very useful in everyone's closet. And I think it brings this outfit together with the black details and a little pop of green and my gray pants. Hello, hello, it is Sunday. I am just heading out to go to Home Depot. We had to get some more stuff for the stairs. We are finally done scraping all the old paint off, so we are gonna try to stain and all that jazz now. We had some water line issues yesterday, so I didn't end up going to my parents, so I didn't have a second outfit for you, but I'm gonna see if I can get you one today, but we'll see. I'm wearing my teddy jacket from Topshop. Super, super cozy. So I'm wearing another teddy thing underneath. It's a teddy sweater from Urban Outfitters. It's really, really cozy. It's really old, so they don't have it anymore, but Everlane has something very, very similar that I'll link. And then I'm wearing my Levi's 501 skinnies in the black slash grayish color. And then I'm wearing my Nike blazers in the light pinky mauvey color. Hello, hello. It is Monday, but this is going to be my last outfit of the week because I couldn't bring you guys with me to Huntsville to show you my outfits of the day. I'm kind of recreating it, semi, semi recreating it. So this is what I wore the second day I was in Huntsville in terms of the bottom layer. I paired it with my super puff because I think it looks better with it, but I only brought my one green Woolrich jacket with me. So this is just like kind of like a restyle. So this is a gray cashmere toque. I love the thick band. It's super easy to wear. I've had it for five to 10 years. I can't even remember when I bought it, probably closer to 10 years. All right, so this is my cashmere gray sweater that I got from Shop Op from their sale during the winter, I believe. I really like the sleeve because it has like a really cool pattern going on and gives it a really cool shape. It's similar to my H&M one, but because it's cashmere, it's a lot softer, a lot more, a lot easier to tuck into uh, into jackets because the H&M one does tend to bunch up and make me feel a little bit uncomfortable if I have a jacket that's too tight. I chose to just bring the one necklace because I knew I'd be wearing scarves and like a lot of sweaters and I just didn't want the hassle of having to layer too many on and also risk losing my other necklaces. So I brought this one. It's super easy to keep track of one necklace versus like three or four. And then I'm wearing my Citizens of Humanity jeans. These are the live style that they don't make anymore, but they're I believe their Arlo straight is very, very similar. And then I'm wearing my Common Project high tops. I didn't wear, bring these to Huntsville because I only brought like the one pair of boots and super, super high Vortex boots because Huntsville is a little bit more intense in Toronto. But this is how I would style them in Toronto slash Guelph now. Okay, so that's it for this week's What I Wore video. I hope that you enjoyed the outfits. I hope that you guys are staying warm. This week's supposed to be a lot warmer in Toronto, so hopefully it's warmer where you guys are too. And I will see you very soon. If you like the video, like the video. And if you can subscribe to my channel, that would be amazing. I really hope to grow the channel even more this year. And if you want, you can even follow me on Instagram right there. And I will see you all very soon.